In today's video, we are going to look at circle geometry. For one to be able to solve any problem in circle geometry, one should know how to state each theorem in circle geometry and also take note of how the shape of each theorem look like. Please note that each theorem number is just for reference purpose. Theorem 1. The angle at the center of a circle is twice the angle at the circumference. Consider the following shape. For theorem 1, we are going to look at these three figures. For figure A, this is the angle at the circumference that is twice this angle at the center. For figure B, this is the angle at the circumference that is twice this angle at the center. For figure C, this is the angle at the circumference that is twice this angle at the center. Example 1. In the diagram below, O is the center of the circle. Find Q. Q is equal to 2 times 41 degrees, which is equal to 82 degrees. Reason, angle at the center is twice angle at the circumference. Example 2. In the diagram below, O is the center of the circle. Find R. R is equal to 2 times 126. R is equal to 252 degrees. Reason, angle at the center is twice angle at the circumference. Example 3. In this diagram, O is the center of the circle PQRS and angle PSR is equal to 86 degrees. If angle POR is equal to X, find X. X is equal to 2 times 86 degrees, which is 172 degrees. Reason, angle at the center is twice angle at the circumference. Circuit geometry theorem 2. The angles in the same segments are equal. Let's consider the figure below. The angle at A is equal to the angle at B because both of them are in the same segments. The angle at C is equal to the angle at D because both of them are in the same segments. Let's look at this question. Find the lettered angles in the figure below. Solution. A is equal to 40 degrees, B is equal to 40 degrees, and C is equal to 32 degrees. Reason, angles in the same segments are equal. Circuit geometry, theorem 3. The angle in a semicircle is right angle, that is 90 degrees. Consider the figure below. This is the angle in the semicircle, that is 90 degrees. Example 1. In the figure below, PQ is a diameter of cycle PMQ, center O. If angle PQM is 63 degrees, find angle QPM. Solution. Angle PMQ is equal to 90 degrees. Reason, angle in a semicircle. Angle QPM is equal to 180 degrees minus 90 degrees minus 63 degrees. Reason, sum of angle in a triangle. Therefore, angle QPM is equal to 27 degrees. Circle Geometry Theorem 4 The opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral is supplementary, that is add up to 180 degrees. Let's consider the figure below. In this figure, A plus C is equal to 180 degrees, and B plus D is equal to 180 degrees. Example 1. Find the lettered angles. Solution. M is equal to 2 times 70 degrees which is equal to 140 degrees. Reason. Angle at the center is twice angle at the circumference. N plus 70 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Reason. Sum of opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral is supplementary that is 180 degrees. N is equal to 180 degrees minus 70 degrees which is 110 degrees. Circle Geometry Theorem 5. The angle between a tangent and the radius at the point where the tangent touches the circle is a right angle. That is 90 degrees. Let's consider the figure below. In this figure, OB is a radius, and ABC is a tangent. The angle at B where they meet is 90 degrees. 
Hence, angle OBC is equal to 90 degrees. Example 1. Find the lettered angles in the figure. Solution. In triangle OBC, angle OBC is equal to 90 degrees. Reason. Angle at the point where the tangent touches the radius is 90 degrees. So, A, plus 4A, plus 90 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Reason. Sum of angles in a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. Collecting like terms, A, plus 4A, is 5A. Which is, 5A is equal to 180 degrees minus 90 degrees. So that, 5A is equal to 90 degrees. Dividing through by 5. A, is equal to 18 degrees. Hence, angle OCB is equal to A, which is equal to 18 degrees. Angle BOC is equal to 4A, which is 4 times 18. Therefore, angle BOC is equal to 72 degrees. Please subscribe and share this video in order to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks. Circle Geometry, Theorem 6. Two tangents, drawn from a point to a circle are equal. Let's consider the figure below. In this figure, tangent PQ is equal to tangent QR. Also, angle OPQ is equal to angle ORQ which is equal to 90 degrees. Example 1. TA and TB are tangents to the circle, center O. Given that angle ABT is equal to 50 degrees, find A, angle ABT, B, angle O, B, A. Solution A. Triangle T, B, A is isosceles. Reason. Tangent T, A is equal to tangent T, B. Hence. Angle ABT is 1 over 2 times 180 degrees minus 50 degrees. That is 1 over 2 times 130. Dividing through by 2, angle ABT is equal to 65 degrees. Solution B. Angle OBA is equal to angle OBT minus angle ABT. Angle OBT is equal to 90 degrees. Reason. Tangent and radius are equal at the point where they meet. Please click on the description to watch Circle Geometry Theorem 5, to understand this reason. Angle ABT is equal to 65 degrees. Therefore angle OBA is equal to 90 degrees minus 65 degrees which is 25 degrees. Circle Geometry Theorem 7. The angles in alternate segment are equal. For any circle, the angle formed between the tangent and the chord at their point of contact is equal to the angle formed by the chord in the alternate segment. In this figure, the chord PQ divides the circle into two segments. Then, the tangent AB is drawn such that it touches the circle at P. Hence, the angle QPB is equal to the angle in alternate segment angle QRP. Also, angle APR is equal to angle RQP which is in the alternate segment. Before we proceed, my channel analysis shows that 94% of those watching my videos are yet to subscribe. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button in order to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks. Example 1. Find the angles marked with a letter. Solution. Angle DBE which is M, is equal to 50 degrees. Reason. Base angle of isosceles triangle. Angle EBC which is K, is equal to 50 degrees. Reason. Angle in alternate segment. Angle DEB which is P, is equal to 80 degrees. Reason. Also angle in alternate segment. Please subscribe to my channel and share this video in order to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks.